Once we make the commitment to change, to undergo that transformation, to accept the dark night of the soul, um, then the confusion sets in because we're in the unknown now. Mm. We don't have a map. We don't have a way to navigate like we do in the outer sphere uh, with regular knowledge. We know, okay, I, I can ask my teachers. I can go to the university. I can ask my parents. I can ask my grandparents, my friends. It's kind of feeling lost a little bit and yes. like out of doubting yourself and that confusion is that... Um, why did I cross that damn threshold? <laughs> Somebody you know, should have did, physically stopped. Yeah, me. like it's like you're. It's too late. To, it's a point of no return. But yeah. you're still, um, you're still thinking about what my. If, what if I just stayed where I was? Right. Yeah, there's that longing for our, our comfort zone. Mm -hmm. You know, the familiar, and uh, there's no going back at a certain point. And it feels very discombobulating, especially when you do the inner work, like when we do shadow work. Your your the identity that you relied upon so much for security and I go to and your mm -hmm. your survival kit that you use that seem to help you function in the world is like kind of thrown out the window and now you have to really cultivate who do I want to be in this situation who make conscious decisions and it's empowering but also scary because you're you, there's a tendency to want to rely on the old way you used to mm -hmm. do things and stepping into doing something new like speaking up or trying something or speaking in public that you you've never done before um it's it 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 you know the ego it has it's doing its job it's saying slow down so confusion is a is a state of fear that we get into and the fear the confusion can cult create more fear but if we want to really work with it we have to say um oh i see what's happening you're conscious of the journey that you're on and you're saying you know this is why i'm confused it doesn't mean that I can't make it. It, it means mm. that I just maybe don't know what the next step is yet and just go inside and get divine guidance, you know, get go in. It's a place to go inward versus giving up or stopping. Because if you stop in this yeah. point, like it's almost better if you just never took the journey <laughs> at all. But you see people who go halfway and they stop. And they just stay in that confusion. And, and sometimes for a long time, if they don't have a guide yeah. to take them on the way. So then the guide swoops in. At the time, the hero is like, oh, I just want to give up, right? That that kind of, you always see those stories where it's like, oh, like, I can't, I can't take one more step. And then psh, the magical wizard appears or something comes in and, and is, uh, offers guidance. Exactly. Uh, confusion, let's say, is a state of chaos. And chaos cannot really exist for very long mm -hmm. in the universe. It, it, there is really no pure chaos. It's always, there's always a tendency towards order, towards mm. form, towards structure. And so the structure comes in now at a higher level through a spiritual teaching, mm -hmm. a higher knowledge, uh, a deeper understanding. Uh, it might be just a book that opens up a door for you uh, maybe a teacher maybe a coach maybe a mentor a guru maybe some just an internal resource that you find within yourself that you say i have this faith this way of understanding my confusion and and my path the the path that i'm on uh, that's guiding me from mm. within so it's it doesn't necessarily take one form it can take many forms and a variety of forms and actually a great spiritual guide or coach helps you cultivate that resource within yourself not yeah. give you all the answers or, or come in and swoop and rescue you they're really a reflective of your own inner wisdom and so sometimes you can't find it within yourself so yeah. you need some someone on the outside to reflect it back to you that's all it is it's not the source but a reflection